If we can't afford to get blasé about jewellery, familiarity breeds contempt for even spectacular sports like water skiing. But one couldn't be blasé about the gyroboat, the brand new idea of a young American ex-aircraft designer who decided he'd get a big lift by attaching a helicopter blade to a dinghy pulled by a speedboat. The gyroboat can be transported as easily as any normal dinghy and only takes five minutes to assemble. Here is its designer, 26-year-old John Hofstetter, who hopes that soon gyroboating will be a recognized water sport. This particular speedboat is fitted with a 75 horsepower motor, but John says you can make do with 35 horsepower as long as the boat is capable of maintaining a speed of 20 miles an hour or above. This is the speed required by the gyroboat to lift itself out of the water. John Hofstetter estimates that you can fly the gyroboat after about an hour's practice. But experts always make things look ultra easy. Believe us, a takeoff like this depends on a good deal of know-how. On the other hand, you can acquire that know-how, but John is planning to start a gyroboating school. in the air, you can cast off the tow line. It's just another of the peculiarities of our legal system, though, that you can't do this without having obtained a pilot's license. And while we're on the subject of peculiarities, John is working on a two-seater model, especially for steel-hearted courting couples. <laughs> 